Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax, the channel that's here to help you build your dream garage. And today I just received a package from Sonic Tools. So let's jump right into it. So if you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. And if you're a longtime subscriber, always good to have your back. Quick update on the July giveaway. You only have five more days to enter. The winner will be chosen on Friday's video, so be sure to check it out. So a couple weeks ago, I did my review on my Sonic tools and cabinets. If you haven't seen that, check that out. But then I also did how to submit a warranty claim with the Sonic tool process. Very simple. You can use your phone or your computer. Just log on, take a couple pictures, submit them, and then they'll be able to review your warranty claim if your tool is broken, and then they'll send you the new tools back out. So since that video, I had a couple comments saying, clearly Sonic are bad tools because you had a couple tools break already. Keep in mind, guys, tools break. Things break, things happen. I'm not worried about something breaking. I'm more worried about how often it happens and why it happens and if the company stands up to what they claim. Let me show you what actually broke. Right here you'll see I have a circular file, an impact socket with a cover for lug nuts, and then two T25 Torx bits. Now the Torx bits are identical products minus the impact socket size and they broke because I was doing a very aggressive project and that was making some ice racing tires. That project broke 15 uh, drill bit T25s at least and then I started using my Sonic tools. Out of those 15 uh, DeWalt T25 bits, I could do about five or six screws a, a, and then it would break. With these T25s, I was able to do at least two tires on each, and I had 140 screws on each tire. So I really think these held up to the test of time. Now that we have that out of the way, let me just briefly tell you how their warranty program works. First, you complete the claim online, either on your phone or the computer. Second, they have 24 hours to process the claim. Third, you will get your tools, replacement tools delivered to your house. Fourth, you will unpack your new tools and see if they request you to return the broken tools. Some tools they'll want back and some tools they don't need back. Fifth is if you have to send them back, they will have the return labels in there where you can, number six, pack them up and send them back to Sonic. So guys, as you can see, a very simple process. I submitted my claim at 11 a.m. on July 17th. By 11.32 on July 17th, I got an email from a customer service rep saying we have received all of your warranty claims. By July 21st, I received my package. So it's really a simple process. So let's jump into seeing if they ship the right tools back to me. So the only way to open a Sonic box is with the Sonic uh, Zacto, so let's jump into it. So guys, I'm pretty funny here. Um, <laughs> I've got my, my tools that are broken, I've got my impact socket here, I've got my file, and then I've got my two uh, T25 bits, and then they are sending uh, example of their laser etched um, process they have but they send a 10 millimeter socket so to me that's some funny advertising uh, and great advertising to show off their laser etched uh, tool and then they send us a 10 millimeter because we all know we all need those so as you guys can see it's a very simple process I got all my warranty tools replaced no return label so I do not have to ship any of them back and the bonus 10 millimeter socket. So guys, if you're considering getting Sonic Tools, be sure you check out my other videos on Sonic Tools. I'll leave them below. But until next time, thanks a lot for tuning in and I'll see you next time. <laughs>